Welcome to Blue's Bakery, where it always smells sweet and delicious. We better get bacon. Come on. So, what do we want to bake today, Blue? Ooh, Blue wants to make babinka. That's a kind of cake. Oh, yeah. That's my Lola. Lola means grandma in the Philippines. I love her so much. Yes, it's true. And I miss you so much. It's been with And her babinka is masarap. Mm. Masarap means delicious in the Philippines. So, who are we baking this for? Okay, we'll play Blue's Clues to figure out who we're baking the babinka for. We're gonna play Blue's Clues, cause it's a really great game. Yeah. Now remember, Blue's paw print will be on the clues. The Blue's Clues. Oh, right, the paw print. <gasps> oh, masarap? I'm really going to need your help today to figure out who we're baking the babinka for. Will you help me? Great! Hey, you know what we need for Blue's Clues? Our handy dandy... Notebook! Notebook, right. <laughs> Cookie, to play Blue's Clues, we got to find a... A paw print. Right, a paw print, because that's our first clue. Yeah, a clue. And we put it in our cookie. Hmm. Put it in our cookie, because they're whose clues? Blue's, Blue's clues. clues. Mr. Salt, was there anyone else in the kitchen when your first pie went missing? Bow, bow, bow. Oh, yes. Bow. Someone in these photos was in the kitchen. Oh, and, uh, do you remember anything else? Hmm. Whoever was in the kitchen was taller than me. Oh. Magenta? Tickety talk Slippery soap? Or cinnamon? Who is taller than Mr. Salt? Magenta, tickety talk and slippery soap. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah! Magenta, Tickety Talk, and Slippery Soap are the only ones taller than Mr. Salt. So Cinnamon must not have been in the kitchen. Interesting. <laughs> Mr. Salt, do you remember anything else about who you saw? Ooh, I remember seeing the color pink. Oh, that's great information. <laughs> so, Magenta, Tickety Talk, Slippery Soap. Who is pink? Magenta and Tickety. Yes, Magenta and Tickety are pink. So, Slippery Soap could not have been in the kitchen. Do you remember anything else? I remember bells. I heard bells. That's really helpful. Which of our friends has bells? Tickety! Yes! Tickety has bells! Maybe she knows what happened to the pies. Good work, detective! Let's go find Tickety! Au revoir! Which food is salty? Hmm, salty. Oh, well, we have pretzels, cherries, and bread. Huh. Which of these foods is salty? The pretzels. Pretzels are salty, like me, huh? <laughs> okay, <laughs> salty pretzels for our feast. Right, voila. Nice. Oh. Which of these foods is sour? Hmm. Well, 
Uh, we have applesauce, cranberry sauce, and butter. Huh. Which of these foods is sour? The cranberry sauce. The cranberry sauce? Really? Huh. I don't know. I always thought that cranberries weren't sour. Definitely pretty sour. Yeah. Now we need something sweet. Something sweet. Got it. Okay. We have orange potatoes, white potatoes, and purple potatoes. Which of these foods is sweet? The orange potatoes. The orange potatoes? Oh, okay. Let's see. Mmm. So sweet. We definitely need those sweet potatoes for our feast. Wow, you are really smart. <laughs> Coming right up. Oh. Hmm. We need pineapples for both the muffins and the babinka. But I'm not sure if we have enough for both. Will you help me? Great! Yay! Thanks. So, how many slices of pineapple do we need for the babinka? Hmm. Four. Four. <gasps> right! Oh. And we have seven slices. So, if we give two slices away to the muffins, how many will we have left? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five. Five, right. We have five slices of pineapple left. So, hey, is that enough pineapple for the babinka? Ooh. Yes! Oh, right, because five is more than four. Huh. Thanks, we have enough pineapple. Now all we need to do is add some to the babinka. Yum, I love pineapple. Can I have a pineapple muffin too, please? Oh, uh, one moment, please. If we have five slices of pineapple, and we give one to Tickety, how many slices of pineapple do we have left? Four. 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 <gasps> right. And four is just the right amount for the babinka. <laughs> Here you go, Tickety. Yum. Thank you. Enjoy. One, two, three, four. Now, time to put you in the oven. <laughs> Slowly and carefully. We have another pizza order that we need pronto. I need a pizza that's one third pepper. Pepper, please. Oh. Pepper pizza coming up. All right, let's see. So which of these pizzas is one-third pepper? That one. Right. One, two, three. This pizza is divided into three-thirds, and one-third has peppers. Here comes your pepper pizza, Mr. Oregano. <laughs> You are so good at making pizza, but I have one more pizza order. I need a pizza that is one quarter pineapple. Pineapple, please! Okay. Um, hmm. Which one of these pizzas is one quarter pineapple? That one! 
Yeah, because this one has one, two, three, four quarters. And this one quarter has pineapple. <laughs> pineapple pizza's ready, Mr. Regido. <laughs> Ah, beautiful. Thank you so much. You're my heroes. Uh, just doing our jobs, Mr. Oregano. Just doing our jobs. Oh, bo, bo, bo. And we love pizza. Oh, oh. Ah, pizza. <clears throat> oh, bye, Mr. Oregano. Have a good pizza. I mean, day. Bye, Josh and Blue. So, which fruit is yellow? and comes in bunches. The bananas! The bananas! <gasps> right! Bananas are yellow and come in bunches. Thanks. You sure are smart. One bunch of bananas. Excellent choice. And for you, Tickety, may we take your order I would like to order the smallest green fruit on the menu, please. Ah, I see. Interesting choice. Uh, one moment, please. Hmm. Which of these is the smallest green fruit? The pear. The pear? Oh! Right! Thanks. One pear. Excellent choices, everyone. One moment, please. <clears throat> one apple, one pear, one bunch of bananas. <laughs> Coming, Coming right, right up! up. <laughs> ah, here we are. Here is your order. Bon appetit! Thanks! I'm so okay. excited! A crisp apple. Oh, wow! Thank you, Josh! Mmm! A perfect pear. Ooh, yummy! Thank you! Looks scrumptious! Yum! And a beautiful bunch of bananas. Yummy! Thank you, Josh! A bon appetit! Joshy! Lola! <laughs> oh, it's her! It's my Lola! And hello, my little blue! And who's this? Oh, that's our friend! Hello to you, too! Is that Bibinka I smell? It is! And it's finally ready! We made it for you! For me? You made it for me? Mm-hmm. Well, come on. Have a seat. Welcome to Blue's Bakery. I love it. Babinka for everyone, please. <laughs> I hope you like it. We worked really, really hard. Ooh. A slice of babinka for me. <laughs> a slice for Lola. <laughs> a slice for Blue. <laughs> Oh, and a slice for you, too. So, Lola, what do you think? Blue? Josh? This bibinka is masarap. Oh! <laughs> it's sweet and delicious. I love this bibinka. And I love you, too, my little blue. Thank you, Josh. Mm -hmm. Thank you, my little blue. And thank you for helping to make this bibinka for me. You know, you're a great baker. Can you help us find which one is different in this group? Oh, absolutely. Now, which one is different than the others? A carrot, lettuce, peas, Broccoli. Well, they are all vegetables. A carrot is the color... Orange. 
orange. <gasps> orange! And the lettuce, peas, and broccoli are... Green! Green! Which vegetable color is different? Orange! Orange! Right! So, the carrot... Is different! Is different! Healthy snacks! Healthy snacks! We love to eat yum healthy snacks! Uh oh! Oh man! Something is, is, is different from the others? Yes, we need your help. Okay, let's see those healthy snacks. <laughs> mm, well, an orange, a pear, celery, and a watermelon. Well, um, mm, the orange, pear, and watermelon are... Fruits! Fruits! And celery is a... Vegetable. Vegetable. Right. So, the celery... Is different. Is different. <laughs> the celery is the only vegetable. Healthy snacks. Healthy snacks. We love to eat young healthy snacks. Carrots, bananas, and celery, too. Yum! We love to eat healthy snacks, don't you? <laughs> okay, Blue. Are you ready? <laughs> Great! Then let's try the cyclone experiment. Okay, first, we carefully fill one of the plastic bottles with water. <laughs> Ooh, I'm so excited. The cyclone experiment's gonna be so cool. We want to see. Oh, look! It's shovel and pail. Okay. So, next, we carefully tape the second plastic bottle to the first one while I hold it upside down. <laughs> Did someone say upside down? <laughs> hey, mailbox. Oh, wait till you see this. So, after everything's all taped up, we get to swirl it around. <gasps> We're ready to try the cyclone experiment. Okay, here we go. Swirl, swirl, swirl. Oh. Look at that. It looks just like a real cyclone. Oh. <laughs> that was great. Hello, Josh. We need your help with our grocery list. The twins are getting hungry. Oh, no. Oh, it's okay, baby. I got gotcha. you. <laughs> Here you go. Oh. Grocery list. Sure. I got this. Not a problem. Oh. Uh, do you think you could help with the grocery list? Great, thanks. Okay, let's see what we need to find from our grocery list. Hmm. Oh, let's find this first. Do you see this? That one. Oh, what is it? Milk. Milk, just what we were looking for. Aha, milk. Check. Good job. Milk for the twins. Okay, what's next on our list? Well, let's see. Hmm. Oh! Do you see this? Over there! What is it? Nice. Bread for the twins. Bread. Check. Well, I think that's everything. Milk and bread. Merci, Josh. 
Merci, Josh. Anytime. Bye. Bye, bye, bye. I want these circle crackers for my race car. They're the biggest circles. Well, then I want the opposite for my race car. Okay. So what's the opposite of biggest? Smallest. Oh, exactly. Smallest. So, which are the smallest size circles? The pea. Well, there you go, Mrs. Pep. Whoa. Pepper. <laughs> the smallest size circles. Peas. Merci. Oh, you're welcome. Biggest. Smallest. I want this broccoli for my race car. It's the bumpiest. Bumpy. Then I want the opposite for my race car. Okay, so we need the opposite of bumpiest. <laughs> I got this one. No problem. <clears throat> ah, uh, what's the opposite of bumpiest? Smoothest. Smoothest, right, right, of course. So, which is the smoothest? Oh, well, there you go, Mr. Salt. The smoothest vegetable, the mushroom. Merci. Bumpiest. Smoothest. Voila, for magenta. Vroom, vroom. Voila, for blue. Vroom, vroom. Thank you for helping us. Oh, vroom, vroom, vroom. You're welcome. <laughs> Come on. We were wondering... Where does orange juice come from? Well, ooh, where does orange juice come from? Well, it comes from oranges, and oranges grow on... Trees. Trees, right, and orange trees grow from... Hmm. Seeds. Oh, seeds, right. Voila. Voila. Orange, Orange trees, trees grow from, from seeds. seeds. Oh, a seed is planted and then an orange tree grows. Huh. Huh. Look at that. Hey, but how do we get orange juice? Pick the orange. Oh. <gasps> Pick the orange from the tree. Huh. Huh. So, where does the juice come from? Squeeze the orange. Squeeze the orange, right. An orange is squeezed and the juice is poured in a cup. Ooh. Wow. So that's where orange juice comes from. But of course. Okay, so let me get this straight. Orange juice comes from an orange seed, and the seed is planted in the ground. And then the seed grows into a full-grown tree with oranges growing on it. And then an orange is picked from the tree, and the juice is squeezed into a cup. That's it! Nice work, Josh. Hey, good job! Yeah. Hello, I'm Farmer Goat. Are you the waiters from the fancy restaurant? Yeah! Oh, I mean, um, yes, we are. And this is Blue. Bye -bye. Wonderful! Let's go get those veggies for Mrs. Pepper. Bye -bye -bye -bye. Will you help get the vegetables for Mrs. Pepper, too? Great! Then we can go look for more Blue's Clues. Huh. Ooh, basket! Well, first off, Mrs. Pepper wants a vegetable that's leafy. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Which of these vegetables is leafy? 
The cucumber, spinach, or eggplant? That one, the spinach. <gasps> right, the spinach. Spinach has lots of leaves. Thanks. <laughs> Come on, let's go find the next vegetable Mrs. Pepper needs. Okie dokie. Mrs. Pepper also said she needs a vegetable that's bumpy and yellow. Oh, okay. So, oh. ooh, um, which of these vegetables is bumpy and yellow? The corn, cauliflower, or broccoli? The corn, there. Right, the corn. Corn is bumpy and yellow. <laughs> yeah. You are a vegetable expert. Come on, let's find our last vegetable. All righty. We just figured out Blue's clues. And it's incredible news. Hi, Mr. Salt, Mrs. Pepper. We heard about your news. Josh, we have two babies. We have twins. A baby boy and a baby girl. A boy and girl. Sage and Ginger. Would you like to hold them, Josh? Be very careful. <gasps> Hi, Sage. Hi, Ginger. I'm Josh. Say hi. They're so cute. Oh, Sage, Ginger, Blue has a special note for you. It says, Welcome to our family. It's time for so long, but we're gonna sing one more song. Thanks for doing your part. You sure are smart. You sure worked hard when you use your mind. Take a step at a time. You can do anything that you want to do. It's a party in the park. Oh. Here's some delicious pizzas for your party. Yes, it's a pizza party for our neighborhood, neighborhood heroes. heroes. Pizza wow. party. <laughs> this was a great idea, Blue. Oh. <laughs> wow. Oh. Oh. It's a pizza party. Bon appetit. Oh, delicious. Bon appetit. Wow. Thank you so much for all your help today. Oh. You know, you are our neighborhood hero. <laughs> now it's time for so long. <laughs> but we're gonna sing one more song. <laughs> Thanks for doing your part. <laughs> you sure are smart. <laughs> you sure worked hard. When you use your mind, take a step at a time. You wanna do Bye bye. See you again soon, okay? Bye bye. Bye bye. Yummy. Maybe we could draw something to make the boat move. What could we draw to make the boat move? An oar. An oar. Nice thinking. 
Wow! Nice ore drawing, Blue. And we're off. Let's go. Oh, it's a huge wave. What should we do? Faster, faster. Faster. Right. Let's go faster. Oh, no. It's going to catch us. Oh, what else should we do? Um, oh, since we're in a chalk world, let's erase it. Ah, that was close. Oh, um, um, excuse me. Are you Slippery's friend? Yep, that's me. Great! Uh, we have a message for you from Slippery. Slippery says, Hi, I miss you. Love, Slippery. Aw, uh, thanks. I've got a message for you, too. You do? Your last clue holds something to drink. And it's closer than you think. Bye bye Bye, Sunsy! Hey, Blue just drew our picture home. <gasps> Come on. Whoa. What two colors mix together to make chartreuse? Huh. Yellow, green. Yellow and green make chartreuse. Yeah, they do. Bye bye. Bye bye. We make marigold. <gasps> marigold is yellowish orange. Wow. And we make magenta. <gasps> magenta. <laughs> magenta is reddish purple. <laughs> wow. There are so many great colors. What's your favorite color? I like that color too. <gasps> Colors mix above my head. Colors mix above my head. Like orange made with yellow and red. Orange made with yellow and red. Chartreuse. A color I had not seen. Looks to me like yellowish green. If we want violet, we know just what to do. Just mix our two friends, purple and blue. Just mix our two friends, purple and blue. Mix blue and yellow, and they're suddenly green. Mix blue and yellow, and they're suddenly green. Then blue and green make aquamarine. Colors bright, colors bold. So amazing when you stop and stare. Colors, colors everywhere. Colors, colors everywhere. Colors, colors everywhere. and brown just like that coral. Yep, Mimi is an octopus that can camouflage. Oh, bow, bow, bow. camouflage? Camouflage means she can change her color to look like other things. It's so amazing. Mm-hmm, she's basically a hiding expert. Camouflage beneath the sea. Take a look, can you find me, Mimi? She's hiding again. Let's go. Hmm. 
Where could she be? Hmm. Do you see Mimi? There! There she is! I don't see her. What is she camouflaged to look like? Sand! Sand? <laughs> oh! Wow! Nice! You found me again! She was right there! <laughs> ah! She changed her color to brown, just like the sand on the ocean floor. Whoa! Camouflage beneath the sea. Take a look, can you find me, Mimi? Whoa! Blue just skidooed into that picture of Periwinkle City. <gasps> Maybe we can find Periwinkle Stuffy in his old neighborhood. Let's go! Blue Skadoo, we can too. Whoa. This is a really big city. Oh, how will we find Presto here? Hey, one of those puppies could be Periwinkle's friend. Maybe they can help. But, uh, who is Periwinkle's friend again? Rainbow Puppy! <gasps> of course! Rainbow Puppy! <laughs> Excuse me. Hi! Are you Rainbow Puppy? Rainbow Puppy is my name, and singing is my game. La 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 la! Would you like an autograph? Me? Oh, uh, <laughs> well, actually, we need your help. We're Periwinkle's new neighbors. Periwinkle? I miss him so much. How is he? Not so good. He left his stuffed bunny Presto behind, and we're trying to find him. Do you know what Presto looks like? Oh, yeah. Presto is Periwinkle's favorite color. I wonder if he left him at his favorite store. His favorite store? Thanks, Rainbow Puppy. Happy to help. Ta-ta! What if we mix the colors? <gasps> what color would we get if we mix red and purple? Hmm. Magenta. Magenta. Oh, okay, okay. So who do we know that's a puppy and is the color... Magenta. Magenta! Magenta! <laughs> of course! We just figured out Blue's Clues! <laughs> we just figured out Blue's Clues! We just figured out Blue's Clues! We just figured out Blue's Clues! Because we're really Come on! Magenta! Oh, Blue wants to add you to our portrait of pals. Here, Blue, you can paint magenta with this magenta paint we made with red and purple. Our portrait of pals is complete. Woohoo! Yeah! Wow. All right! All yeah. right! Oh, see, there's magenta right next to blue. Mm. And there's you. And there's me. Wow! It's so colorful. I just love this portrait of pals painting. Don't you? Thank you so much for all your help today. Where should we look first? Well, I think Duck went that way. Oh, more footprints. But which ones are ducks?
those. Prince, stop here. Hmm. But where's Duck? There. <laughs> duck! We found you! <laughs> well, hello, little duck. Good hiding. Good seeking. We still haven't found her snail friend. Oh. Will you help us find her? Yeah. Let's go find snail. More prints. Huh. Can you tell which trail will lead to snail? That one. But where's snail? Hmm. Right there. Snail, we found you. There you are. Oh, good hiding place. Thanks for your help. Oh, right. We better get home. It's almost time for Magenta to come over. Bye, Josh. Bye, Blue. Thanks for your help. Thank you. Let's go. <laughs> so, I had seven blue dollars, and then I spent two on that crayon. So how many blue dollars do I have left? Five. Five, right. One, two, three, four, five. Five blue dollars left to spend. So, do you see anything I could buy with five blue dollars? How about those great blue striped socks? Do I have enough dollars for those? No. No. Hmm. Those socks are six blue dollars, and I have five. Hmm. How about that cool hat? Do I have enough dollars for that hat? Yes! Oh, it's three blue dollars, and I have five. Yes! So, what are you thinking? More presents? Yes, I would like to purchase that hat, please. Oh, that's a great choice. It has a guitar on it. <laughs> you can totally buy that hat. That'll be three blue dollars, please. Okay, here you go. One, two, three. Oh, look! I have two blue dollars left over. <laughs> Thanks. One hat coming right up. I love the blue. It's going to look great on you. Thanks. Cool. My new hat. And it's all wrapped up like a present. And who doesn't love presents, right? I mean, not me. I love presents. I love presents, too. Always good to see you, cuz. Thanks, bye. You're welcome, come back anytime. What is this place? It's a, a farm. farm. A farm, right. E-I-E-I-O, we are farming for blues blues. E-I-E-I-O, with a chick chick here and a chick chick. There, come on. Oh, oh. It looks like this little chick is trying to tell us something. Duh. Oh. Hello, little chick. <laughs> hey, George. Can you help me find my friend? Oh, okay. You ready to help this little chick? Then we can look for more Blue's Clues. Okay. Um, but what does your friend look like? My friend has a hat on, just like mine. Do you see my friend? Yes, see how our hats match? Oh, yeah. 
Thank you for helping us. Great work. Hi. Oh. Can you help me find my friend too? Okay. What does your friend look like? My friend has a hat on just like mine. Oh, okay. I sure hope you can help me. Do you see my friend? No. no. Uh uh. Yes, that, that one. one. Aha! You found your friend too! Thank you for helping us. You are very welcome. Let's go! Push can do, we can too. Whoa! Whoa! It's Blue's school! Oh! Hey, Blue! This orange kitten is painting. Looks like she's feeling pretty happy. She sounds pretty happy, too. <gasps> oh. oh no! Look! Look what happened! Oh, how do you think the orange kitten's feeling now? Hmm. Sad. Yeah. Sad. Hmm. Because she's whimpering, hmm. and her face is frowning. Oh, what should I do? Well, what do you think the orange kitten should do? Should she stop painting and give up? Or should she get a new piece of paper and paint again? Hmm. Which do you think she should do? Paint another picture. I think I'll paint another picture now and make it even better. Yeah, right. Because if you just sat there and stopped painting, then you wouldn't have a painting to bring home. True. Whoa! Hey, that was a pretty tough situation. <laughs> Blue did your skidoo! Come on! Blue skidoo, we can too! What is this place? Hey! This must be Silly Town! Do uh, you see anything silly about Silly Town? Come on! It's raining inside that skunk's umbrella. What? Now that's pretty silly. <laughs> hey, you know, if I'm gonna fit in around here, I'm gonna need my handy dandy silly hat. Oh, come on. <laughs> Hello, my friend. Hello? I'm Billy Chicken, mayor of this silly town. Oh, oh, well, it is an honor to meet you, Mr. Mayor. Come along, I'll give you the grand tour of silly town. Great, hey, we love silly stuff. Oh, do you want to find all the mixed up things in silly town? Me too, let's go. Walk this way. <laughs> <laughs> ah, this is our construction site. We're building a new school. Hmm. I wonder if there's anything mixed up here. Hmm. Does this look silly to you? Oh. Well, what's mixed up here? Oh, yeah! Hey, this 
wacky worker weasel is using a banana to pound a nail. <gasps> cool, a story. Let's listen. The duckling felt really sad. And then... <gasps> oh. How do you think Purple Kangaroo is feeling? Sad. Mm. Ooh, and mad. What do you think he should do? Hmm. Should he tell Magenta how he feels so they can share the story? Or should he grab the book back? Hmm. Which do you think he should do? Tell Magenta how he feels. Mm-hmm. I want to tell you how I feel. Sad and mad. Because it's not nice to grab the book. Would you like to share the book with me? Now that's a great idea. To share. Can you help us figure out what comes next? Oh. Yes. Row, row, row your boat gently down the street. Is that it? <laughs> no. Ooh. River. Is that it? No. Hmm. Stream. Is that it? That one. Yeah, it's me, Stream. Oh, well, there you go, Chick Chorus. Yeah. yeah. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Team Green. Uh oh. Which chick is singing the right ending? Life is but a dream. Team Green. Life is but a dream. Hey, I think your chorus is complete. Okay, okay. sing with us. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. dream. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, hey, that was awesome. <laughs> oh, yeah, right, Blue. We still have to get back home for our own. Song time, la la la. Come on. Bye. 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 Come on. Oh. <laughs> ah, our famous park. Hello, everyone. Hello. Goodbye. Hey, what's mixed up here? <laughs> Going the wrong way. The wrong way? Oh, yeah. This giraffe is sliding backwards up the slide. Hey, how do you do that? I don't know. <laughs> I'm just silly. What do you think of Backwards Park? Well, I think it's a very backwards way of life. Hey, do you see any other backwards things? Oh, yeah! Good eye. Ah, oh. Let's go. Beep, 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 beep. Hey, thanks for showing us around Silly Town. Don't mention it. Oh, I left my egg running. Gotta scramble. Good day! Bye. Hey. We gotta get back home and find our last clue. <laughs> okay, felt friends, we'll come and help you. Are you ready? Great.
Whisket do, we can too. <laughs> wow. Oh, hey. What seems to be the problem, Felicia and Fred felt friend? Well, we're trying to figure out where our fruits and vegetables grow. Oh. Okay, well, we are here to help. So show us what you got. Okay, where do oranges grow? Can you show us? Of course I can. One sec. Do you know where oranges grow? Trees. Aha. We were just talking about that with Mr. Salt and Mrs. Pepper, remember? Yeah. Oranges grow on trees. Okay, how about potatoes? Yeah, where do potatoes grow? Where do potatoes grow? Underground. Hello, Gopher. <laughs> Potatoes grow underground. And that's why they always have soil on them. <laughs> Come on. Blue do we can too. I'm flying? In outer space? Yes! Super Josh! In outer space! <laughs> and his trusty friend, Super Blue! <laughs> <laughs> wow! <laughs> I think that was a, a Saturn. Or maybe it was Mars. Well, let me tell you a thing or two about our solar system. Um, um. And who, may I ask, are you? <laughs> I'm the sun. <gasps> you're, you're, you're the sun? Yep, that's me. Wow, you're, you're the center of the entire solar system. Can I just say, I am your biggest fan and, oh, baby, you can help us. <laughs> you see, I can never remember which planet is which and a, uh, hmm. Okay, Josh. Well, the sun's a hot star. Mercury's hot, too. Venus is the brightest planet. Earth is home to me and you. Mars is the red one. Jupiter's most wide. Saturn's got those icy rings. Uranus spins on its side. Neptune's really windy, and Pluto's really small. It's called a dwarf planet. We, we wanted, wanted to, to name, name the planets, planets and now we've, we've named, named them all. You can ask your parents to subscribe to Nick Jr.'s Blue's Clues and You YouTube channel for new videos every week.